When it comes to pasta, most of us buy the dry stuff in the box at the supermarket, but Kim Holcomb met a chef who shows us just how easy it is to make it ourselves. So easy, even a kid could do it. That's tonight's Seattle Top Chef's Kids Menu. Executive chef Bobby Moore has been working at the Barking Frog restaurant in Woodenville for 12 years, but he's been cooking all his life. My dad taught me how to cook at a very young age. He taught me to really cook from scratch. Take him down, take him down. Now a father himself, Bobby is trying to pass on what he's learned to his own sons. Mason Moore, and he's 12, and he's all about sports. Ah! Also Lucas Moore, and he loves to cook. While the boys have different likes, they do agree upon one thing when it comes to dinner. All kids do love pasta. On the menu tonight, ravioli made from scratch. So the pasta that we're going to make today is going to make enough pasta for about 15 nice sized raviolis. He starts with the pasta basics, flour, eggs, salt, olive oil, and water. We want to add the water slowly because we don't want the dough to be too wet. We're going to take this, drop this off, take that dough out of there, and then we're going to knead that with our hands. They make it into a ball and put it in the fridge to rest. While the pasta dough is resting in the refrigerator, we're going to go ahead and start the filling. Lucas has already put in this pork sausage that we actually made. To go with the pork, Lucas preps some kale for the saute pan to go with onions and red peppers. So this is lacinato kale, or also called dinosaur kale. After the veggies are sauteed and cooled, they're combined with a fresh burrata cheese. Burrata is a mozzarella, so it's a mozzarella with cream. And it is, oh, it's so delicious. To press out the dough, Bobby uses a stand mixer attachment, but a hand-cranked roller will work too. So now you're left with this nice thin sheet of pasta dough. Um, thin enough, uh, not too thick. If it's too thick, you know, the pasta is going to be a little bit chewy. Lucas adds an egg wash to the pasta so the two sheets adhere to each other. This is our cutter. We're going to use this cutter to make our raviolis. So I'm just going to gently press down on here so Lucas has an idea of where we're going to put our filling. So go ahead and put the filling in there in one nice scoop. Bobby lays one pasta sheet over the other. Once the raviolis are cut and sealed, they're placed in a pot of boiling salted water. How long are we going to cook those in there, Lucas? Two, three minutes. Two, three minutes. I think it's done. It's done? Perfect. Yep. Now it's time, our favorite time. This is when we eat it. You ready? Yep. All right, let's go eat. Fresh raviolis from scratch. A dish for tonight. A cooking lesson for a lifetime. Cheers, everyone. Cheers. Salute.